The divisional round of the 2022 NFL playoffs are here, and we've got some pretty exciting matchups on hand, starting off today with the Bengals and Titans in Nashville. And I gotta say, what the Titans have been able to do this year without Derrick Henry has been pretty remarkable. A lot of people, myself included, saw Tennessee as a team that needed Henry to set up the play action and pass game for Ryan Tannehill. Without him, I thought that they weren't going to do too well at all. The Titans really haven't changed their game plan much without Henry, which says a lot about Mike Vrabel and his confidence in some of the other guys to step up in King Henry's absence. Between Vrabel and Bengals head coach Zach Taylor, you're looking at the coach of the year on one of these sidelines, as Taylor has led Cincinnati to its first playoff win in 31 years. Yes, Bengals fans, you can finally text about winning a playoff game. As far as the odds coming in, Tennessee is at minus 3.5 with around a 60% chance to win according to ESPN's Football Power Index, and most people seem to be going with Tennessee here, but I wouldn't be surprised if we saw Joe Burrow step up and make a few plays down the stretch, stealing a win for the Bengals in this one. He wasn't at his best last week against the Raiders, but he has been red hot down the stretch here. Tennessee sat last week. We'll see if they come out of the gates a little bit flat. By no means are the Titans a lock in this game. As crazy as it sounds, the addition of Derrick Henry may throw them off the rhythm and success they found headed into the playoffs here. Of course, it would be crazy not to give Derrick Henry the ball in this game and not give it to him a lot. They're going to have to give it to him a lot, assuming that he's healthy, but just a thought. Remember, last year in the playoffs, Derrick Henry was completely shut down and the Titans' offense never got going because of it. We'll see if they mix up their game plan this time around. I see the Bengals taking this game in a close one, 27-24, and moving on to the wait for it, yes, the AFC Championship game to take on either the Bills or the Chiefs, who they've already beat once this year. What about you? Who do you have winning this one? What is your score prediction? Let me know down in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to smash that thumbs up button and subscribe if you have yet to do so for the latest NFL news and predictions. I'll see you all in the next one. Thank you.